Yeah, what's up you guys? This is Guy Sin and I'm doing a Boom Beats video this time you guys because Supercell had flew me out and a few other YouTubers for the secret reveal that they're doing for Boom Beats. So I have the pleasure to announce it to you and let you know what exactly it was. And basically you guys, I'm really excited for it because uh, this is going to be equivalent to a Clan Wars but for PvE. That means player versus environment. So uh, we had Dub War Master of Daddy. Molt Gaming, me, Chief Pat, and a lot of us guys uh, that were able to test this out and play the game as a PvE. So it's like the Clan Wars. I'm really excited for it. If you can see now, we're going to go in and show a live replay of uh, one of us going in. I believe this was uh, Daddy or Chief Pat going in here, but uh, they're going to use uh, tanks and medics. And let's see how this attack goes. But you guys, just to let you know, uh, I am actually considering playing this game now because I had just so much fun uh, playing this as a Clan Wars type of thing where we had to work together and we had to strategize and come up with a way where we could take out the enemy's um, camp campaign level and coordinate our attacks together so that we could do it. Now, th actually, this is going to be Daddy. Let's see how Daddy does it. Okay. And I think he was using that tank and medics. Uh, and now it's it's, uh, it's actually pretty interesting using tanks and medics. No, you know what? He's actually going in with the rifle dudes and the rocket guys. Only like three medics in the back. And uh, he's using the electric attack that should pause the enemy defenses. I'm just going in and uh, saying hi to all the clan mates. So... The goal, unless you guys have been playing Boom Beach, the goal of this is to get to the center of that power cell looking green thing right there. You got to take that out. And But the weapons on here have such a long range. So you have to be careful and you have to coordinate your uh, troops to go around so that they're not in the enemy's fire. So that you can take out the main goal, which is that power cell in the middle. Now I'm still kind of debating what troops I should use on this because such I'm such a new guy to the game. Uh, I really liked seeing the other guys play because they were using warriors and those guys could just pretty much get through all of the defenses. But you know I think the biggest problem that I had was I, I didn't upgrade my troops. I'm still learning the game and figuring out what to upgrade or not. Uh, but uh, this is an example of it. See he had a, this was uh, I believe Nick at night. He was using all uh, warriors to go in and they're such a good uh, troop to use now if you notice like he's just he didn't really spam them all together but he's like coordinating it so that they all move up towards the goal and they're taking out this other stuff some of the youtubers actually just went around all the weapons to take out the rest of these things i forgot what these are called they're like power cells or something but they took those out and that got them closer to the goal for like you know because i believe you have to do a hundred percent on the base all of the youtubers so that it's a uh, confirmed attack, or how you say this, so like it's a completed attack. So he's actually in range now, he's gonna take out all these. I don't believe he's gonna be able to take out the whole thing because these little towers in the back are gonna uh, snipe him out. But I should be, I think I came in next and took out this uh, building structure here with my tanks and my uh, medics. So you guys, uh, I'm I'm really interested to know what you think about this. This is really a game changer for me as far as Boom Beach goes. Now I'm actually considering uh, playing this game now because it just was such a really cool update that they showed us. And just to re uh, recap everything, you guys, if you've checked out the other YouTubers, uh, the things that we were offered were Task Force, Intel, and Operations. And this is all just related to this uh, war mode that we have here. So, I mean, it should be out live. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's going to be live very soon, if not this week, so you guys can test it out yourself. So let's actually just check out this last replay, and I believe this is Gaming with Molt. He's using these Rocket Women's and these uh, Machine Dudes. I forgot the names of these guys. I'm just so new to the game, but they are really strong. Uh, the guys in the front, they just spray all of the weapons down and just are like the anchors of the team right now. And so... Uh, you know, if you notice, the base was pretty much partially destroyed because of another YouTuber that was attacking it. And so the way it works is he comes in and tries to clean up, 
cleans up the rest of this to get to the goal because I don't believe any single person can take on a whole base by themselves. That's why this is a cooperative uh, game type where you have to work as a team together to take out a base. And some of these bases can get so hard that you need just tons of people on your team to make it happen and you're all coordinating and making it work so you guys if I hadn't said this before this is just a really interesting game type to where it's making me consider actually playing this game now and hopefully you know if if, if you guys comment down there and let me know what you think about this if you guys are a boom beach player let me know if you want this on my main channel or second channel and I actually might just start doing this so you see he took out the middle of the base and that destroys the rest of the units out here the building structures and that's the case closed. So you guys, let me know what you think. Thank you for watching. This is Boom Beach's new update coming out soon. This is Godson, and I'll see you guys next time. Godson out.